Hello, my lovelies. How are you doing? <laughs> Let me put on my second set of eyes here so I can see. Oh, mm, getting older is just mm, itchy something else, y'all. I have bright pink on today because I wanted to feel good. I wanted to be silly. Um, yeah, I even had my, I mean, oh, <laughs> I even have my bright pink shoes on. <laughs> yes, I do. So, <laughs> very little makeup on today. Um, I did freshen up my lips for you, but me and hubby, he felt well enough to go out. So, if you can see in the background here, we went to thrift stores. Three, four, three, four thrift stores today. And I found exact well, not exactly what I was looking for, but stuff that I needed because as y'all know I'm getting ready to redo I'm redoing my craft room organization one of the things that I want to do is get rid of the tall bookshelf that I have in the corner here and slide the other tall one down so that I can have a little bit more wall space to put beautiful things <laughs> so yeah um okay I'm rambling on uh First thing I want to show you is something that I refurbished or redone or done, put together, whatever, for a hubby. Uh, after Valentine's, you know how they always have their Valentine's candy on sale. Well, we found a box of chocolates um, that had minions on the front. And it was shaped like a heart. And uh, hubby just loved it. He wanted to, uh, you know, I got to put something in the back of this to make it stay. But anyway, um... So he loved the, the the top of the box. And so he cut it out after I had all the chocolate. <laughs> Actually, I didn't need all the chocolate. You know, I shared. I was good. But um, so he asked me, or, you know, I was looking at it, and I said, well, I guess I can make you something out of that, you know, and everything. So I did. Here's what I did. Now, first of all, let me say this. Y'all know he loves the minions. Well, he has a shelf in, in our bedroom that has all his minions on it. My bedroom is decorated in peacocks. It's gray and blue and, you know, that kind of color. So, putting minions in there has been a sacrifice for me because I like things a certain way. <laughs> yeah, I'm that way. Um... So, in order, you know, making this for him, I had to come up with something that would be a compromise so that he can hang this on the wall over his little minion shelf. <laughs> so, here it is. Ta-da! So, this is a, an 11 by 14 frame. And what I did was put a background of blue and we... I took the top of the box and trimmed it up really good and put it down on the paper. And then I took washi tape because the paper wasn't quite big enough. I took the sparkly blue washi tape and put around it as a border. So there you go. And this is the little 3D minions. Yeah, it's a 3D thing. I don't know if y'all can see them. There you, there you go. Anyway, so there you go. That's what you do when you love somebody, young people, is you make compromises and you sacrifice. <laughs> yeah. So anyway, that's that's the first thing I want to show you. Let's get on with these hauls. <coughs> um, I went shopping, of course, uh, and bought a few things. First part is from Michaels. Michaels. Now, because I am redoing my craft room organization, I went in there specifically <laughs> looking for something to put some beads in. Found these. These were uh, storage items were forty percent off, so these were a dollar seventy nine down from two something. Two forty no yeah two forty nine something like that. <clears throat> so I found those. Now what I got really super excited about 
um, they had their uh, hot buys going on. Yes, they did. So I found a couple things that I really wanted, and they were five ninety nine each. So yeah, I got them. The first one is the washi, the unicorn washi. And let me take this thing out. I'll show you this top one, so because you, you can't see it, but it's got the gold foiled unicorns with all of the rainbow. Regular price was nine ninety nine, so it was five ninety nine for this set of washi. It's so pretty. Yes. And then I found it, y'all. Yay! Y'all know I've been looking for this ever since it first came out. And I, I, I pulled a Karen because I actually got down on my knees in that stupid <laughs> store going through every paper pad they had because I was looking for this. Uh, I had a lady walk by me and go, are you okay? And I'm like, I'm looking for a paper bag. <laughs> so I finally found it. And I know y'all have seen it gone through and everything, so I'm not going to go through all that. But I'm so super stoked over that. <laughs> Crazy, I know. So I got two things I really, really wanted. Now, and two things I really needed. <sighs> the next part of this haul is the Dollar Tree. I went back to the Dollar Tree. Whoops. Actually, this is from four different Dollar Trees in my town. I actually missed one. Forgot all about that it was there because it's new. So let me pull this stuff on over here so I can show it to you. And I mean, I got a lot of stuff, y'all. I got multiples of stuff. Um, but, yeah. And I'll just show you what I got. I knew that was going to happen. I'm trying to get to the books because I did find some really good books. And I'll just bring one of these over since we know what they are. Okay. Usually I have this stuff closer. Today I'm just, like I said, we just got back. I'm disorganized. I haven't got things done. Okay, Dollar Tree. <coughs> they have new stickers out. And I hope y'all were able to find them because they are stunning. So this first one here, and these are all, they have some kind of like shimmer, glitter, or something on them. Every one of them do. But this is the one that says fun. Good times. Just look at those stickers. Oh my gosh, they're gorgeous. So I got one of those. This one says life. Life is beautiful. Oh, just love them. Y'all know me. Spring's my favorite season. This one says love and uh, that's all it says. But yeah, spring is my favorite season. I, fall's the second one, but spring is my favorite. And this one says spring and wish. And this is the reason why, because of flowers. I, and I got two of those. I love flowers. This one here, if I had been able to find more than just the two packs that I bought, I would have. Because I absolutely, positively adore this sticker set. Look at that. Oh my gosh. Tell me this is not gorgeous. Let's see if I can get the glare off of it. Look at look at all the little rain boots there as planters. And the bus. I love this. And this, oh my gosh. And they're all 3D. Every one of them. And it says pop-up, but I'm not sure how it I don't I don't I don't want to open them yet. But anyway. <laughs> Every one of them say pop-up, so I'm wondering if that's 3D or if they actually do do something. I'll let you know. Okay. Found some more glue. This stuff is hard to find. So I got two. So I got that. I bought, y'all know I love pencils. I have a collection of pencils like you would not believe. And I don't care. I'll keep adding to it as long as they keep coming out with beautiful pencils. These, look at these, with the little bunnies on them. And the, this one has the Easter egg and the flowers. And this one just has flowers and then just this beautiful teal color. So I got that pack of pencils. And then, straws. 
you know, I'm sure y'all, everybody's seen the Easter straws. But look at these. Oh, they're so cute. So I'm hoping to, to make some stuff soon. Duct tape they have. And I think this has been out a while. I have, you know, I, have, I think I've seen it one time, but I'm not sure. But I got a roll of that. And then I got a roll of this because this is new and it's so pretty. Look at that. Love it. So I got that. <coughs> and, um... In one of the Dollar Trees, they had the acrylic organizers. Now, I did not need any of the makeup type organizers, but I was hoping to find these. And I found eight, and I bought all eight of them because y'all know how hard they are to find. So, I'm going to take um, tacky dots, and I'm going to stack four together, and then I'm going to take the four and tacky dot them to each other so that I'll have like eight drawers excited about that so yeah found that and then this is this is funny i bought four sets of these right these are the little essentials brand clip lock storage the little ones uh five fluid ounce size these were not even in the storage bins or any of the kitchen stuff or anything like that somebody had taken these and i'm sorry i went and bought them but i did because i saw them Someone had taken them and hidden them behind some food items. And they were sticking out a little bit, you know. But they had set all four packs up there. And I was like, you snooze, you lose. Because I need these. So I bought them. I pulled them right from behind there. I needed them. And they were there. Somebody had hit them. <coughs> Don't hide your stuff. Really, people? <coughs> and they had these. And I had been looking all over the place for these. Uh, two. They had two. They're the little tiny, um, it says hardware storage case. And they're in the tool department, right? Where the men's tools are, not men's tools, the tools are. And they close all the way to the top, so they make excellent bead storage. And they're small, so you can put light beads and stuff like that. Anyway, so I found two of them. That's all I found. I need like a. 50 of them. <laughs> uh, let's see what else. I uh, found these. These are the really long ones. And I bought one, two, three, four, five, six. That's all they had at this Dollar Tree. I bought six. Yes, I did. Found one of the three part compartment acrylic thing. And then I found four of these these acrylic ones just the open top ones so i found those yes because i'm i need to organize i need i need stuff <laughs> okay let's get on to the books i think i found some really cool books first found the um a love that multiplies about the duggers so i got that one i think karen's already highlighted that and then I don't know if y'all remember seeing the movie Girl Interrupted with, uh, oh gosh, I can't think of her name. Anyway, good movie. Well, the lady that wrote that book wrote this book too called Cambridge. Got high praise on it. I mean, just wow. And uh, this is, says an ex exploration of memory and nostalgic Nostalgia set in the 1950s among the academics and artists of Cambridge, Massachusetts. And, you know, just, oh, it, it just sounded so good. So, I picked that up for a good read. And then I found this and I thought, I read the, you know, the insert, the back and the insert and everything. And I thought, this sounds really cool, you know, just for a quick read. But it's called Freud's Mistress. So... And uh, the price has been covered up, so don't know how much it was. Yeah. Oh, goodness. But, yeah, so this was, uh, <laughs> just reading the inset sounded really, really cool. And then I had this book before the fire, I think, it was this one. Yes. And it's by Christine Avanti. Um, CN, which is a uh, certified nutritionist, and it's skinny chicks eat real food. 
kick your fake food habit, kickstart your weight loss. So, and also the price is covered up on that one too. But, um, yeah, it, this, I had just bought in that book too. Um, but I mean, it's got some pictures of food in here. Just, uh, make your mouth water. Mm, mm, mm. I love a good salad. I've, as a matter of fact, I got to go to the grocery store and pick up some salad stuff. So I got that. And then I found this because I, you know, I'm trying to, <sighs> yoga is a good way to ease pain. Um, <clears throat> by stretching and stuff like that. And I have a, a ball, so I thought, I seen this book, and I thought, well, let's try that. Um, I used to work, as when I was a personal trainer, I used the ball quite a bit for my clients. Um, so I know, you know, I know how to use the thing. But I thought incorporating yoga with it would probably be kind of cool. And um, this is a really good book. I mean, it gives you detailed pictures, it even gives you an appendix of muscles so that you know what muscles you're working. But the pictures are awesome in it. I mean, it just gives you detailed workouts um, or yoga. And then it talks about, you know, why this certain um, exercise, yoga pose or whatever works. Um, so, yeah, it's a... Uh, I was so excited to find this, y'all. Mm. Anything to help ease my pain, I'm all for. <laughs> I really am. So, that, I know I have rambled really fast through this. Um, okay, I'm going to close. Um, it's been a while since I put up a video, and I apologize. I've got so much going on right now. But anyway, um, yeah. Yeah. I love you guys. I thank you so much. I appreciate you so much. Um, I'm so thankful that you are a part of my life, that you comment, that you send precious friend mail to me. That means so much to me. And it makes me feel so loved and so honored. And, uh, yeah, you're just special. Very, very special, my lovelies. I can't say it enough. Um, so, yeah, I'm going to get this stuff put away. And then come back with the thrift haul. So, thrift store haul. <laughs> so, yeah. I love you guys. Talk to you later. And uh, don't forget to love on each other and to be kind. And may you all have a wonderful and blessed day. And I will catch you in the next video. So, bye from North Carolina.